The world of U.S. Navy aircraft carriers is fascinating and mysterious. These colossal floating fortresses dominate the open seas, projecting military might and readiness to defend and protect across the globe. But amidst the synchronized chaos of operations, a profound question emerges. Is intimacy even possible for these thousands of sailors during their extended stays on board? The sense of camaraderie among the sailors is unparalleled, but it comes at a price. One wrong step can disrupt the harmony and throw the entire ship into chaos. The crew members undergo intense training exercises, grappling with challenging scenarios to maintain the aircraft carrier's formidable strength and unwavering readiness. There are important rules they must follow. The first rule is that there will be no open religious proselytizing. While freedom of religion is respected, actively attempting to convert others to a certain religion is generally not permitted on U.S. Navy aircraft carriers. This rule ensures the respect of everyone's beliefs and helps maintain harmony aboard the ship. Proselytizing can sometimes lead to disagreements and divisions, which could harm the cohesion and teamwork necessary for the ship's successful operation. Another rule is that there will be no unauthorized decorations. Unauthorized decorations in living quarters, such as posters, photographs, or non-regulation bedding, are not allowed on U.S. Navy aircraft carriers. This rule serves multiple purposes. Firstly, it helps maintain a professional and uniform environment, reinforcing the collective identity of the crew. Also, it helps keep the living quarters neat and orderly, which is crucial in such a confined space. Want to know if there are also restrictions on sexual activity? Stick around until the end of the video to learn more about it. The next rule is about restrictions on personal electronic devices. In the digital age, personal electronic devices like smartphones, laptops, and gadgets are attractive to everyone, including sailors on aircraft carriers. However, such devices are often restricted on the ship due to security concerns. Aircraft carriers are involved in sensitive operations and any leaks of information could be dangerous. Personal devices that emit heat could expose important secrets or compromise operational security. Additionally, excessive use of personal devices can distract crew members from their duties, potentially hindering critical tasks. Another rule is that there is zero tolerance for drugs. The use of illegal drugs is strictly forbidden aboard U.S. Navy aircraft carriers. To ensure the safety and effectiveness of the crew, random drug tests are conducted to enforce this rule. Drugs can severely hamper a sailor's ability to perform their duties, making them a liability to the ship's operations and the safety of the crew. It is essential to maintain a drug-free environment to ensure everyone's well-being and the smooth running of operations. Do you know pets are also not allowed? Pets are generally not allowed on U.S. Navy ships, with the exception of working or service dogs under certain conditions. The main reason for this rule is to prevent disruptions to operations and the health risks that pets can pose. Having pets on board can cause distractions, interfere with duties, and potentially create hygiene and cleanliness issues. Exceptions for working or service dogs are made under specific circumstances where their presence is necessary to support crew members. Lastly, there are also restrictions on sexual activity. On U.S. Navy aircraft carriers, there are specific rules limiting sexual activity. This policy is in place to maintain a professional and respectful working environment. The ship functions like a floating city where hundreds of men and women live and work together for many months at a time, often in close quarters and sharing tight sleeping spaces. Preventing sexual harassment and misconduct is a top priority to ensure that all crew members feel safe and respected in their workplace. This commitment aligns with the Navy's principles of equal opportunity and non-discrimination. Additionally, restricting sexual activity helps avoid potential fraternization or inappropriate relationships between ranks, which could undermine the chain of command, disrupt the hierarchical structure, and erode discipline and order on the ship.